I don't like that. Hmm. Would that make me look like an asshole? Yeah, I don't like it. I wonder if this comes in black. Shit. Guess I'm not sleeping tonight. Besides, tomorrow's just another meaningless Friday. Just another hopeless turn of the earth upon its axis, which us humans, an organic collection of monkeys, have deemed a significant amount of time. I'd even question the purpose of spending our lives celebrating dead men, but I love the holiday sales too much. I will never understand humans, the most intelligent beings on this planet, and we still have trouble finding our keys in the morning or remember to pack our bags. Most of us too stupid to understand what we want out of life. Hey, go take your break. Great, now I can finish reading my electronics catalog. Maybe if I take on a double ship next week, I can afford- Hi. Are you some type of tech guru? Depends. Do tech gurus miss out on discounts on merchandise? I don't know, but now that I'm talking with you, I think you're more like a shopping guru. Can you tell me what to wear this summer? Sorry, that's actually on the next floor now. Oh, well, someone told me to come here. Can you give me a list of numbers you can call? Hmm. No, I think I'll try again. Hello? I'm talking to a guy and he seems he can't take a hint. Really? Would you like to see him this weekend? Hmm. I was hoping to see him sooner than that. You know I'm free tomorrow night around 5. Yes. Yes, that sounds good. Thanks. Pick me up tomorrow. I want a dog. Why do you want a dog? What? Dogs are the best. Is that even a question? I would totally give you up for a dog right now. It's good to know where your priorities lie. Besides, they're expensive. How can you put a price on love? I would totally save up money and get me the cuddliest puppy ever. I mean like the expenses, like the maintenance, the food, the vet. I still say it's worth it. Still don't think it convinced me to get one though. Hey, it's me. I'm trying to reach you, and you haven't been making up my call. So, I just want to know you're okay. Can you please call me back? Bye. I'm hoping everything's fine with you. Just give me a call back and let me know you're okay. Last time we spoke, you sounded really strange. Bye. Go ahead and leave it with the others. Thanks. Can I come in? Let me pop first. I did. What's the last time you took a shower? Is everything all right? No, I'm just worried about you. It's been days since you haven't picked up the phone, and last time we talked, you sounded strung out. I'm fine. I've just been having problems sleeping. <clears throat> Look, we barely talk, and when we do talk, you're always distracted by stupid online auctions. I just want to know if this is going to work. You're the only one that can bring me down to earth. I mean, besides, I can afford all this. It's not just your money you're wasting. You're wasting your life right in front of me. So now you got a problem with how I spend my life? Just because I'm not spending every waking moment with you? If that's how you see our relationship, then yes, it is a problem. Would you like to come in and talk about it? No. You need to stop this uncontrollable shopping habit. Here. What's this? It's a place you can get help and you don't have to fight this alone, Alec. So this is where my life has placed me. I used to think I was just a speck of dust spinning aimlessly through the universe. I had no purpose, no life. It wasn't until some strange girl showed me just how worthless I was that I understood it myself. Don't ask me why she had any faith in me. I couldn't tell you. Because of her, I finally understand why I'm here. The real reason I found meaning is them. Without them, I could never have anything truly worth caring about. This is the one who saved me.